Scientists tricked E. coli bacteria into generating electricity from wastewater. Swiss scientists have genetically modified Escherichia coli bacteria to generate electricity from brewery sewage. In their research, scientists used an innovative approach that could revolutionize both waste management and energy production. Ever since British mycologist Michael Cressay Potter noticed in 1911 that brewer's yeast produced electricity, scientists have been trying to exploit this feature of microorganisms. However, until now, the efficiency of these tiny bioreactors has been too low for practical use. An additional problem was that microbes can be picky about the substrates they digest to produce electricity. Now a team of scientists from the Federal Polytechnic University of Lausanne, a coal polytechnique Federale de Lausanne, EPFL, has modified one of the most common species of microorganisms. The Escherichia coli bacterium, significantly increasing its ability to produce electricity. In addition, modified bacteria are no longer so picky and are able to produce energy even from brewery sewage. The innovative approach of Swiss researchers offers a sustainable solution for the processing of organic waste, also opening new horizons for energy production. We have modified E. coli, the most widely studied bacterium in the world, to produce electricity, says Professor Ardemus Boghossian from EPFL. Although there are exotic microbes that naturally generate electricity, they can only do so in the presence of certain chemicals. Our E. coli can grow on many different substances, which has allowed us to generate electricity in a variety of environments including wastewater, he adds. E. coli bacteria have been used to generate electricity in a process known as extracellular electron transfer. Eat. EPFL researchers have significantly increased the efficiency of this process by creating highly efficient electrical microbes. Unlike previous methods that required specific chemicals to generate electricity, the modified E. coli bacteria can produce energy by metabolizing various organic substrates. To increase the energy-producing efficiency of E. coli, scientists modified its genome by adding instructions for producing certain protein complexes found in Schuonella onidensis. It is one of the most famous bacteria that generates electricity. By integrating the electricity generating mechanisms from S. onidensis into E. coli, the researchers tripled E. coli's energy producing efficiency. The modified E. coli bacteria demonstrated remarkable performance in a variety of environments, including wastewater collected from the brewery. During tests, while other electricity generating microorganisms waned, the modified E. coli thrived, showing its potential for large scale waste processing and energy production. 
Instead of supplying energy to the organic waste treatment system, we generate electricity while processing this waste, says Boghossian. We tested our technology directly on wastewater collected from Les Brasses, a local brewery in Lausanne. Other electricity generating microorganisms, including S. Onidensis. Editor's note. We're not even able to survive in this environment, while our bacteria multiplied exponentially by feeding on this waste, he adds. The implications of the study go beyond waste treatment. Capable of generating electricity from a wide range of sources, the modified E. coli bacterium could be used in microbial fuel cells, electrosynthesis and biosensors. Additionally, the bacterium's genetic flexibility means it can be tailored to adapt to specific environments and raw materials making it a versatile tool. Our work is timely as modified electricity generating bacteria are suitable for an increasing number of real-world applications, said Mohamed Muhib, lead author of the paper. We have set a new record compared to previous solutions. With all the current research efforts in this field, we are excited about the future of this type of bioelectric bacteria and look forward to us and others pushing this technology to new heights.